What's up everyone, Takedown here. Welcome back to another hockey card video. Today I'm going to be sharing some more of my eBay finds. And most of these cards were anywhere from $1 to about $3 to $4 on the high end. But I'm going to be hopefully remembering what I paid for most of these cards and just explaining it. Not just to brag about it, but just to share what you can find on eBay if you look hard enough. So up first is a Young Guns for Max McCormick which is a great Young Guns, in my opinion at least, because I'm an Ottawa Senators fan. This is 15-16 Series 2, and I picked this up because I'm a fan of the Ottawa Senators. I like getting Young Guns, and to have a 2-in-1 reason to buy the card is awesome. That card is only a dollar. And also, I like to get Ottawa Senators cards from players past and present, and more specifically, Young Guns for players past and present, present for the Ottawa Senators. So that's why I also picked up Mike Condon, who recently got traded away. I was not expecting that because they put him down into the minors to basically help improve him with his skills, and it kind of backfired and they had to trade him away. But I do enjoy him. I think he's awesome. And this is 15-16, so I do have his young guns, even though he's not part of the Senators anymore. Next up, as you guys know, I have a Tyler Sagan collection. So up first is a Tyler Sagan Relics for the Champs card. This is 15-16, and honestly, that looks like a great uh, jersey card. I think it looks pretty cool. That's why I picked it up. This one here is only, I think, $2. And I have another Tyler Sagan card, which is a 15-16 Series 2 for Tyler Sagan. So I have a few for this year for jersey cards. Honestly, I like picking up patches when they're colored, but because it's Tyler Sagan, I have a Tyler Sagan collection. I wanted to add this one, and for honestly only $2, to me, it's worth it. Because jersey cards, I find most of the time they're up to $4 when you try to purchase them off of eBay. So to find one for $2, it's a player I collect. That's why I picked it up. Next up is Malcolm Subain Upper Deck Rookie Portrait. So I have a small Malcolm Subain collection. I'm a fan of his. I have his rookie materials and his young guns. So to add this one, that is why. 1516 uh, Series 1 Upper Deck Rookie Portrait. I think I only paid a dollar for that one as well. Next is a Jacob Forcheck MVP rookie card, which I know for me, I don't like to go for MVP cards, but because it's Jacob Forcheck, it is a rookie card. I have a small collection of his. That's why I wanted to pick this one up. I was actually hunting for his Young Guns card, but every time I would start bidding on it, it would go up way too fast, and it was not worth me purchasing. I couldn't justify paying a lot of money for it because I try to bargain hunt when I'm going for hockey cards. So that's why I went with this one here. I can't remember how much, but it's definitely less than a dollar. And also to stay on the same theme of Jacob Vorchek, I did get another card of his, but they also sent a bonus card. It is a rookie commerce card, a commence card, and let it focus here for a maxim. Um, I probably butchered that because I'm not familiar with his, so that's a cool card to get. i just not familiar with the player, so that's the bonus card that they sent me whenever I ordered the Jacob Forcheck Premier card. So this is the Premier card in my opinion, not just because it says Premier, but this is the best one for this order in my opinion, or one of the best ones because it is numbered. 147 out of 199, which I loved getting numbered cards. I love the patch because it is a colored patch, which is what I try to go for whenever I find them. It is a pretty big patch. It looks awesome on this card. I love the orange because of the flyers. And that is awesome. I also have a flurry card in the same year in the same set. Um, I think it's numbered 130 out of 199 if I remember correctly, but because I have a small Jacob Vorchek collection, I've seen this one, and this card was actually free because eBay once again did the, I think it's $5 free purchase or whatever, so I think I paid 10 cents on this, so I basically got it for free, I only paid the 10 cents. So that's pretty awesome, that is my favorite card out of that I just got, but I have one card left which is a dual jersey card. For Tuka Rask and Shara, which, as you guys know, because I just said it, I like collecting Ottawa Senators players past and present, and Shara used to be on the Ottawa Senators. I also collect goalie cards because Tuka Rask is a goalie. That's why I also like this card here. And also because it is a dual patch card, which I love getting jersey cards. So it's 
has multiple purposes why I purchased this card. This one here I think is three, no, I think this one here is four dollars, so. This here is a great card. It's not numbered, but a dual jersey card for two great players for the Boston Bruins, a former Ottawa Senators player, and a goalie. That is why I purchased this for my collection. To me, this is a great card, but comment down below which card that I just shared that I got off of eBay is your favorite. I hope you guys did enjoy this video because I've just been looking on eBay, trying to get deals, trying to add stuff to my collections that I find, that I like, and that are a great deal on eBay. So that's why I wanted to share this. So I hope you guys did enjoy this hockey card video. I will leave it here. Please take care. Peace.